Hello, I'm Craig Jackson, and today I'm going to take you through the process that we are using to embed YouTube videos into PowerPoint. Microsoft has content out there, and there's lots of things out on the web that say all you have to do is this. Unfortunately, it doesn't always work that way. We are looking at a YouTube site right here. If you come down to share, you will notice here's the address that you would normally share if you would send it out or if you just put it in a in a PowerPoint where you could link on it. What we have to do is we have to embed this and when we embed the code we have to use the old embed code instead of an iframe. We will copy this and when we go to PowerPoint we do insert video from website and we paste this in. Now I'm going to break this out just a little bit so you can take a look at it and show you each one of the parameters that that we're seeing here because the parameters are the areas that we're going to have problems with right now. As you can see all I have done is just broken out the different parameters and the object tags and so forth. As you can see right here, here's our movie value which is the YouTube video and then it's got some extraneous information back here and it's the same thing down here in the embed portion of it the source file has different things so we're going to go ahead and insert that and as you can see it just jumps right in and when we hit play it says we have to do something different so what we're going to do is this we're going to come in again insert video from a website paste all of our information in here and again break this out by parameter so you can really see what we're doing and how we're fixing this. Now remember we talked about this information right here. If we go back and if we look at our YouTube file remember the video is right here everything is fine except when we get down to the bottom of the of the stuff right here you've got a question mark and some extraneous code so what we're going to do is we're going to take all of that out we're going to make sure that the movie value is enclosed by parent I mean uh, by quotation marks and then down here in the embed source we're going to do the same thing we're going to take out from the question mark all the way to the zero once we do that, now we've got the same address that we had on the YouTube file. When we insert it this time, now watch what happens when we hit play. And so that's all you've got to do is when you are importing and when you're embedding a video from YouTube into a PowerPoint presentation, make sure you take the extraneous code out of the file and then put it back. As you can see, now it's playing just fine. So that's how you want to go about creating the embed code and, and revising the embed code that you get from YouTube to make it work in a PowerPoint presentation. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to contact me.